far too much red air. I don't think we're losing very many planes. We're just not doing as well in the air as we would like to. I would definitely like to get another Doctrine. Yes, please. Delay. Leg infantry gains plus 10 organization. That's good for our infantry, not so good for the cavalry. Ah, it's really bugging me now that cavalry don't get Doctrine buffs. I think I might have doomed this playthrough just because cavalry suck. I know they suck. <coughs> the Inquisitor. We have quite a lot of war support. We could probably do with improving... We'll be able to get some more political advisors soon. Chakov would give us some more experience per day, which would allow us to get the doctrines more quickly, though I don't think we're going to have any real problems with that. Slowly but surely, building up more and more and more and more. I mean, the other thing that we could try to do is prepare to go to... I mean, we'd need to get to extensive conscription, actually, which would be 270. And we're talking about total mobilization, which would be that. However, is there... Women in the workforce? Yes. What's it require? Non-aligned, 84% war score, which we have, and 70% stability, which we don't. We could do some anti... No, that loses us stability. How much does this actually gain us? Because that's 0.7 a week. That's a fair amount. So 120 days divided by 7 is what? 17, so we gained 7 stability from that. Or if we do this, it's 180 divided by 7. 25, yeah. See, this just gives us so much more. We're going to take the improved working conditions. Get me that stability. And let's see. 1941. Spanish Empire declared war on Bourbon, France. Oh! Spain's throwing in with, um, Italy, basically. That's actually incredibly good for us. Artillery upgrade. This is also going to upgrade the medium cannon. What gun did we go with on the tank? That wasn't the medium cannon, was it? Seems I remember how to design those. Oh, that's in there. Still getting used to the tank designer. We went with the automatic cannon. Which was that. We could upgrade it to a medium cannon. Oh no, it makes it quite a lot more expensive. Alright, so what upgrades... The automatic cannon. Is it still in here? No, that's just the medium cannon. Okay. Yeah, automatic cannons there. Okay, so we need to upgrade our AA. Cool, cool, cool. Noted. Ah, we can get another air doctrine. More ground support. Sounds good to me. Huzzah! And there we go. Spanish Empire joined Novus Imperium Romanum. So it's the Spanish and the Italians now. 
that's actually going to be a pretty decent bulwark against Germany. Germany is now fighting a war on two fronts, one which I hadn't really expected them to be doing. Now, did my submarines ever arrive? Yes, they did. Can they reach anything? No, not really. I mean, we could be raiding stuff in the Baltic, I guess. Bloody dangerous, though. I mean, actually, one thing I will do is I'll put you guys onto convoy raiding in here, just in case they decide to try to raid me. Gibraltar has fallen. And you guys need a different colour. You can be blue. And you can change to green. Blue, because it's near Sweden. Sweden's always blue. Cool sign Slinky, thank you very much for the 37 month resubscription. Very much appreciate the ongoing support there. Cool sign Slinky, thank you. Hope you're doing well. Are scout cars in the builder? Are there options to make them more worthwhile? Yes, scout cars are in the builder. And you can give other vehicles wheels if you wish. Makes them better in open land and deserts. Syrup God! Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the channel. Good to have you joining us. Alright, let's boost our aircraft absolutely everywhere where we can. I'm not really using the command power for anything else. I very rarely do. Oh, that's a breach. Let's not do this, guys. Oh, that's an army that's not actually here. Where are you? You're in the north. You're in the middle. You're in the south. You're in the south. You're in the middle. That's why the middle is holding out better than the others. Right. Evade the blockade with Portuguese convoys. Nah, not necessary. I'm not really importing anything except for, um, rubber. The main way that I would be screwed is if Japan declared war. How are we doing for heavy tanks? We can bring in another division of heavies. Which I think... I'll do here. Another division of steel Cossacks, if you please. And we shall name this the Brandons 629. Whoops. I used to be able to touch type numbers absolutely perfectly. Out of practice. Spanish Empire has called in dictatorial Guinea Bissau in as an ally. Oh, I don't like how much they're pushing me here. I think what I'm going to do is drop the amount of... No, I do actually need all of those guns. We're going to drop the amount of those we're making. Uh, support equipment. Support equipment. Hang on. We have 3,000. I haven't put it in my infantry divisions yet. This will give us more. <laughs> this gives us more entrenchment. Of course it does. Only two more, but hey. It's, it's, a, it's an upgrade. It's an improvement. Here's hoping you can industrialize faster than the Germans can push us. I mean, one thing that we could probably see about that is they have 140 civilian factories. I have 99. So I need to outscale them. I probably need to get about 170 maybe.
I mean, they're expending themselves attacking against us as well. Like, their equipment isn't amazing either. How do you make more Chief of Army? I'm a little surprised that these guys can't. Oh, once you're level 4, you can. That's why you could, because you're a level 4. Right. Is this game vanilla or modded? This is vanilla with the upcoming DLC. Available tomorrow. Alright, you're going for this supply hub. I see you. Uh, do I have any reserves? <laughs> um, no. I don't usually believe in reserves. However, I think that in this instance we need to take this back again. So what we're going to do is cancel the tank divisions. It's all open. Oh no, there's a river there. Mm, let's not attack on that side. Oh, there's the rail gun. There you go. Big good stuff. Now, bear in mind that my tanks are pretty old, and there aren't actually that many tanks in there. Rebuild the Saviour Cathedral. Done. So let's go ahead and get the Synod. Does that require the Declaration too? No, that just requires that. Okay. Cool. With the Seminar in Nova Dvechi reopened, they should be encouraged to hold a Synod to discuss the matters of faith that appeared since they were last allowed to hold such an assembly. We gain 5% more political power. Out of 35 day, please say this. Yes, yes, yes. Alright, is there anything we have a lot of? We have a lot of trains. We have a lot of trucks. We have a lot, a lot of trucks. We've already got down to the number of trucks we're producing there. And the number of guns we have is dropping still. Kingdom of Navarra has capitulated. Oh, but that was... Yeah, that was one of German's allies. Oh, go Spain. Oh, Bourbon Empire, hang on. Oh, no, you're a German ally. Damn. <laughs> I'm getting all excited there. Of course, they're the, uh, the British puppet. Right then, you guys. Your planning prep should be there. So I'm going to say... Just if you've arrived, give it a crack, although the artillery is helping them out. Unfortunately, our units just aren't as good at this as they used to be. I thought, I say, our support are doing a decent job. Let's have all of you hit that. And then after that, I think I am going to hold my tanks in reserve as a backup unit. We have another technology. Uh, it is 1941. That's two years ahead of time still. Oh boy, we don't have the computing machine. That was a mistake. We can get another air doctrine because those are remarkably cheap. Supply is an issue there at the moment, but hopefully it won't remain a problem. Now pushing this back here, which is not amazing. They're going to attack us and use up all of their organization, which I'm perfectly happy to allow them to do. 
What do I think of the rework to infrastructure? I really like it. I think it's very, very well implemented. It's solid. Um, I need to be careful that I don't make this sound too much like a review. <coughs> Suez Canal's blown. In response to hostile forces closing in the Suez Canal and risking losing ver vital commerce artery to the enemy, Great Britain has instead chosen to blow the canal to ensure its use is denied to them. Through a combination of block ship demolitions and mining, the destruction is quite complete and will likely take months of extensive industrial effort to repair. Interesting choice there, Britain. Uh, how are we doing for heavy tanks? We have enough for another two divisions. Oh, hang on. You're ready for office. Should be. Oh, there's the chief of the army. <clears throat> we have a level 8 attack now. Blimey! You can get army offense. You can also get the cavalry specialist. I think they're making you the offensive guy because you do already have offensive doctrine. And we can get another Cavalry Specialist, which would be you. Yeah, you can for sure be the Cavalry Specialist. And you can be the... Oh, no. uh, try that again. There we go. Boom. And then what we can do is we can go to the Army Office and say, we want Army Offense which is Shukro, because he's still gaining experience pretty dramatically. And then we can bring in our other army chief, which will be the cavalry specialist, to make the cav stronger. 1941. We can... Get better engines. Oh, no, no, we want to get the AA. So we can upgrade the cannon. That's what we want to do. How long do you think it will take Kaiserreich to update the new features? I strongly suspect that all of the big mods are going to take months to upgrade to this. Like, Kaiserreich will probably have an easier time than, say, Old World Blues. I think Old World Blues and World of Blaze in particular are going to have a hard time. Why are we... Oh, they're still trying to attack. Um, don't. Now you're just wasting resources and supplies. We can assign another two heavy tank units. And considering how much we're buckling here around Minsk, I think I want to continue upgrading you. Although, actually, it's out of interest. Your armor is 35... Hardness is not very good. How's that compared to these guys' armor? Zero. <laughs> so yeah, it's an upgrade. Soft attack 136, soft attack 158. Divisions are like twice as expensive though. And you could in fact get engineer companies. Now we were holding off on getting the engineers could afford it just because we wanted to get like flamethrower tanks or something like that but I think at the moment having the extra entrenchment would probably be the better investment oh man we're getting obliterated there um is that because of a shortage of troops yeah this yellow line is not going all the way up they've just taken Vitebsk which does mean that supply here is going to be a bit more problematic.
Synod done. Right, let's get the reformalize the role of the Patriarchate. Which will give us some more stability as well. For too long has the Patriarchate been relegated to the shadows of communism. For it is time once more to formally it is time it once more takes formally its rightful place at the center of Russian society and culture. This also reduces consumer goods required, which is going to be amazing. So let me actually build some more stuff more quickly. Manpower is going down pretty fast. So is Germany's, though. Oh, that, that would turn. Right, I had... Yes, I have enough. Three more heavy tank divisions. Which will be you, you, and you. I need the subscriber list. And this is going to be known as Blind Baccarat. And you are going to be Unsongdi. And you are going to be... And the Chair. Alright, awesome. Carry on. Do we have train guns yet? We don't. Germany does, but we don't. get some better tank divisions. Alright, let's move you guys over here. Put you into Vitebsk. France is getting some serious... No, it's not. Spain's getting pressured. Italy's doing okay holding right now. I would like to take the Tepsk back. Okay, so we're doing some more of the civilian factories at the moment. We did say that we need to outscale Germany. Which right now we are not doing. We need a... It's like 150 or something, wasn't it, we needed? Germany has about 120. So if we get to 150, I'll be pretty happy. But that's going to take some time to get to. And I'm not entirely convinced we can afford to do it. It's done, that's good. April 41, we could get the tank upgrade. Does this still increase hardness by 100%? Yes, you do. Okay, I think we're about to take the Teps back. We also need to take you back again. Unfortunately, the Germans are proving to be pretty good at attacking. I wonder if they've got some attack bonuses right now from Barbarossa. They have intel. They have air support. It's the air support that's messing with us. Well, hopefully we can take the Tepsk soon. Big guns roaming around. 
There we go, Vitebska's fallen. Now we need you guys to get back into that position to hold what we've just taken. Because Setsov is injured. That's annoying because he's one of my better commanders. Get some counter attacking going. We definitely need to push back here and push back here. Like, there are two major salients that they're kind of establishing against us. We've taken Viteps back again. The only question is can we hold it? I'll say there's the center that's responsible for that one. South Africa has capitulated. That's not good. One of our infantry units arrived, but your organization, wow, it's going down fast. They can pierce my light tank armor. Yeah, not that surprised. Armor of only 16. Those light tanks are so out of date. Mobile defense, here we go. Now we can get elastic defense. And with elastic defense, what we can do now is say, that is my preferred tactic. Potentially some juicy pockets. Yeah, I don't disagree. Um, it's, it's not all bad that we're getting this. Patriarchate's rebuilt. We can also get another Air Doctrine. I feel like there need to be more things to spend air power on compared to the other two. Although I guess you get the variants. Okay, so here we go. Reconvene the Zemsky Sobor. Political power gain plus 15%, stability plus 5, which will mean that we go above 75 stability, which meant something good. Oh, that means we can get total mobilization with women in the workforce. Sweet. Alexander Kazembeck and Anastasi von Stasky return from exile. Return of the Tsar. Provisional government of the provisional Rus no. the provisional Russian government is recognized by the international community. We can then create factions. Here we go. In ages past, the Russian people could assemble in a form of parliament called the Zemsky Sobor to discuss matters and decide issues. Until we've decided on which path we wish to take our country on, we should let the people decide what concerns them all. have inflicted the most casualties. Italy is getting soft. Oh, Pete's sake, you too. <laughs> ah! Heavy tanks, no. We're losing more and more guns. I think artillery we're actually gaining on. Fighters we're losing just. I think we need to go something like this. And then we should be roughly stable. Kursk we're still building uh, factories in. We'll be working on Chernigov soon. We're up to 101 mil uh, civilian factories. We're getting close to what Germany has now. Yeah, if we have to, we can withdraw some of the troops from, from the center. What do you guys actually like? Those are some solid units, actually. That's an 18 combat width? No, 24. Huh. Wish I had some more artillery spare. I could give it to you. 